welcome back to my channel. My name is Lena, and today's video is going to be a barn vlog. a lot of different things. So today I'm going to show you my rides with Bella and Castar. So Bella has gotten about a month off just to kind of rest since she's been training really hard. So I've been, she's been in work for about a week now. So today we're actually going to start putting a little bit more pieces together. So I thought I would kind of show you where she's at coming off of a vacation. And I've also now had Castar for about a month. So I thought I would also show you guys kind of his progress since the last you saw of him was my very first ride on him since he came to the United States. So I thought that that would be a good idea to also incorporate in this video. So I thought I would start this vlog off by showing you guys everything that's in my tack room. Um, so this is the very closest part to the door of my tack room. So here I just have my, Martin, my running martingale, but I took the running attachment off just because I've been using it as a breastplate for both of them with my spurs on top. I only use spurs with Castar right now, so I won't be using those on Bella. This is Bella's bit and bridle, and then here's Castar's bit and bridle. And then here I just have all my rags that I use for cleaning tack. There's a cute little window, but there's nothing really to see in here. That's just like the horse part. <laughs> and then over there I have my Vienna reins, my lunge line, and actually the the halter I'm going to grab with Castar because his is trash because he's messy in the pasture. <laughs> Here I have two saddle racks on the top. I just keep their saddle pads and then with the girth I use on both of them on top. That's really gross because I need to clean it so just ignore. <laughs> and then on the bottom I have my saddle. They down here is a bunch of extra stuff that I don't really use. Then here I have both their grooming kits. Bella's is the box on the bottom. Castar's is the little open caddy on the top. This is again just stuff that I use for the trailers, just water buckets and shavings. My boots, I actually brought my boot bag today so it doesn't have to stand like that anymore because it bothers me. And then here I just have my show box. The only thing I keep in here that I use now is just saddle cleaner. I thought it'd be better just to put it in there than having it laying around. Um, so that's in there, but otherwise I just have all my show stuff and like shampoos and stuff in here. Um, and then there's just the caddy down there which I just put my camera bag and a spare tire. I'm gonna start by doing Bella first just because she's inside. Um, Castor is currently on turnout. They're resting pastures, so Bella is on morning turnout instead of all day. So um, I'm going to start with her first since she's already inside. That way Castor can enjoy being outside for as long as possible.
toes till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, No, I don't wanna waste what's left And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways Till my shadow turns to sun rays And on and on we'll go Through the wastelands, through the highways We just did like walk, trot, canter and working on keeping balance and kind of just rocking back on her butt a little bit. Um, just make sure that we didn't lose a bunch of muscle and that she still knows, how to, still knows how to do that. I put some liniment on her back. That's why I put the cooler on and I'm going to let that sit for about 10 minutes. Um, so while that's sitting, I'm going to go ahead and take Castar out and start grooming him. And then when he's ready to tack, I will go ahead and put Bella away. Around these walls, fighting to create a song. I don't want to miss a beat. Now I'm in the indoor because Castor is going to be in here. And I'm going to set up some poles for him. I'm going to do one set of trot poles because he needs to work on straightness. And then one set of canter poles to work on getting on her, his butt as well as straightness is just a little bit easier to be straight with trot poles so we're going to do a set of both
guys. So to fit my entire aesthetic of never having anything go the way I planned it to, cast star threw a shoe, so he was not rideable today, so I just hosed his legs off um, to get all the mud off, cleaned him up, and then I just put him back, and he'll get his shoe on in two days. But now I'm going to show you guys how I clean my, my tack, the products I use, because... Okay, so I don't want to bore you guys um, with exactly how I clean my tack because I've made a video about this before, but I have gotten questions on what I use to clean my tack in one of my Q&A videos, so I thought I might as well answer the question now. So I use the Voltaire Glycerin Soap um, for cleaning my boots mainly. I use um, the Voltaire Hercules Leather Balsam. Um, about like once a month on my bridle and my mar my bridles and martingale just to get them really nice and soft. And then I use this Bates leather balsam on my saddle. It works wonders. It makes every saddle where the Bates saddle is really really sticky. I just use the leather therapy wash spray on my boots and my bridle. Usually not as often on my boots, but whenever I would just want to quickly clean them. And this is what I mainly use on my bridles and martingale, just to get them nice and clean. But with all this quarantine stuff and the rules changing every day, I feel like I never know if I'm going to be able to come out tomorrow. So I've been using the Hercules Glycerin Soap every day, just to kind of really keep my saddle stuff clean, in case I can't come out to the barn the next day, or however long we're going to be quarantined for. So that's one thing I've just been doing, just in case I can't come out and clean my tack. I don't want to come back to all my stuff being ruined. So that is what I'm going to do now. My battery and my camera is running low, so um, I'm not going to be able to film all of that, but thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you'd like to see me on a more daily basis, my Instagram will be linked down below, Leah and Bella Grace. Comment down below if you have any other video requests for the future, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys!